Roses, it's Sugar Rose Studios, and today we're going to be doing a tack unboxing video. Before we get too far into this video, please make sure to go check out my website. I have custom providers and other stuff that is for sale. And definitely, if you're new, subscribe to my channel because I really, really love that and like this video. So this tack is from Schleich Tack on Instagram and she started making tack when she was 11 and a half years old. She loves making rope halters and she's actually working on making a website which is super awesome but it's not fully up to date yet but you can still order through messaging her on Instagram and look at just like the detail of all of her wonderful pieces. They are so amazing and after opening this package I am happy to say that it is really amazing quality and you will not be disappointed. I think it's really important to share other people's work. Um, I know that I have a little bit of a larger following and platform than some of the smaller artists but they are equally or even way more so talented than I am and I would really like to just show you guys some of their amazing stuff and just they're so talented so thank you guys so much for sending me this stuff. Alright so this is from the Netherlands and I'm so excited that it has come and let's open it. So this is like my tack making area in the shed so I have a lot more room than I did before and now let's open this up. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. What the heck? I think these are just all pictures from the Netherlands. Oh my gosh, look at these beautiful rope halters. I thought she was only going to be making me three rope halters, but like this is so amazing. I'm going to put these all on horses and take pictures because it's really hard to tell on the camera like what these actually look like. So, oh my gosh. And the packaging is so cute. There's roses on it, guys. That's like perfect. These are like my favorite colors ever. I am obsessed with pastel colors. Whoa! Oh my gosh, the braid on this one is incredible! Okay, I'm gonna unpackage all of these now. Okay, so here's the like red and orangey one, and like the braid is so pretty on this. And it comes with the lead rope too. And then here's the blue one with the black and white. It's so tiny. Like, look at the comparison to my hands. Like, Whoa. Like actually these are so small and they're so beautiful and I really think the braid on this one is so cool. It's like alternating pink and green. It's like my, I think it's like a watermelon color, color combination. I really like it. I love the colors on this one. Um, so it's like the, the reins are blue and white and then the braid here has like a little bit of like blue in it and then this is like the top part. And that also comes with a neck rope which is adorable too. And this one I think has to be my favorite. I love pastel colors like so, so much. It's so cute. And then there's this black and red and white one, which I also think is really awesome. And I think there's so many like geldings that could look so good in this. And then this one, which is also I think my, my second favorite, although like they're all my favorites. So, but the braid on this one is so cool. Like look at that, it is, that is so awesome. All right, I'm gonna put these all on horses. So as putting tack on, which like models usually does, this took like 30, 40 minutes, but it's so worth it. So this is the pink and pastel one. The nose band is just gorgeous on this one. I'm obsessed with it. This is a custom I did. Um, that's like my profile picture on Instagram. And I love the flower crown too. It matches everything that I, I made this flower crown, but it matches the, every, the halter that is absolutely stunning. And this, this, this is a custom I did on the Frisian Stallion, and I think that this suits him super well. It's like a braided bridle. I, I don't know exactly what it's, I mean it's a bridle, um, rope bridle? I don't know how you say this, but you know, literally at my barn all we have is leather halters, so there's all these fancy things that like I've never used before that are super cool, but look at the detail. I'm just like, this is so beautiful, and it matches him super well, so. This is a custom I did on the British Spotted Pony Mare, the Collecto one, and the halter matches the blanket that I made really well. I didn't even anticipate this happening, but it literally matches super perfectly. This is a custom that I recently did on the Fjord Stallion. I redid the mane, 
and this braid is probably like one of my favorites and I love green on fjords I think it's just perfect and I think that this is just like an amazing combo and then this is a custom that I did on a unicorn model that I made into a horse and this one I think looks so good on a piebald like literally the black and red just makes this pop so much and the lead rope is super adorable too I think this whole set looks amazing this is a custom that I did on the Marin Terrier I removed the terrier and this halter looks super awesome on her and I love this like I don't even know what this braid is called but it's super cool the colors are kind of like they go they change from the pink to the green and I think it's really all snazzy and just I don't think I could do this and then lastly, this is the Kamar Stallion, and I love this one. I love the colors, and the braid on this one is super cool. It looks like little waves, and um, I like the brown and purple, like the uh, purple. <laughs> I like the brown and the blue. I think it looks really good together, and I think that this set is just honestly, I think this is, I, I mean, I can't choose. They're all I like them all like in their own way so I can't really choose a favorite honestly they all look amazing and now I'm gonna go out and take some pictures so much for watching this video please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel also check out my website i'm closing questions very very soon and don't forget to stay sweet Mwah.